Hey guys, I'm gonna work my Bravo grip sequence from Close the Guard. Guys, I bring this lapel and control my hand right and stay. I can control on the same hand like this. My right hand control his left lapel, the same side. Okay? He gonna posture and I gonna break his posture with my knees, touching the, the putting the pressure behind his elbow. Put the hands to posture. Look like this. And my right hand gonna give the lapel to my left hand over his shoulder, over his shoulder like that. When I have this control, he can't posture. Try to posture, do He can't posture because I control him. I'm stepping my left foot on the hips and I open space. You see, guys? Now, how I work the choke. I use my cross grip. The first, I use the pound down. The pound come. Look the pressure from my right elbow. Come to the face. Pound down. Use the hand behind the neck, no over the shoulder. You need a tight, strong grip there. Here. Now look how how I bend the elbow and I can't break the posture. And my opposite hand come under my arm. I grab the collar, the cross collar. Okay? You can't see the space. But then here, breaking his posture, I grab the cross, hold on, and you can see now, my arm come in, boom, no posture, no defense, with that, okay, the second, number two, you will be, with the same control, with the same lapel, I break his posture, boom, and give the hand, and it passed. But now, number two, I use my palm up. This control of the palm up, I use the same pressure from the elbow. It's important. This way. You feel? If you don't put pressure, you look to me, he was the head on this part. I pressure him down. I use my foot to escape. I use my hips like arm bar on his right arm. Like I'm blind. But when I do this movement from the hips, I can see the neck on the other side, the opposite side. I use the regular choke here. Boom. It's the number two. Number three, I use the same lapel. Break the posture again. Pass the Lateral to opposite hand, I use again my palm up, the palm up, the same pressure from the elbow, foot and the hips, and the same movement, I move, 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 when I do this movement, he understand that I use the regular choke, look what he do, he gonna block my elbow with his hand, it's easy, I will bring when he block my elbow I bring his elbow I cross his arm open 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 between my chest and his neck look the pressure I can control his slip he choke <coughs> next one break his posture Cross the lapel behind. This is important. A strong grip to break his posture, control his posture. If he posture, he can't escape. Okay? I use my foot on the hips, open space, make a grip, palm up. Then number four, next variation, I use the same movement with my hips. I move like an arm bar on this arm, one option, okay, can be, but hey, work on the chokes, he gonna use the hand to block 
I open the elbow again, but I make a, when I cross his arm, when I cross his arm, I'm straight. I grab the, his lift and straight. Next option, I let go the lapel, grab the pants there. I use my movement to escape my hips and put the second hook and use the seat belt to take him back. 